Louise Lear, hello. Thanks, George. Well, the weather is stuck and repeat for some, but not for all. A beautiful day today across the Northern Isles and up into Aberdeenshire. Not a cloud in the sky, but that really was the exception. Most of us had these leaden-looking skies, didn't we? We waited with the showers, and when they arrived, boy, did they linger across much of southwest Scotland, stretching into northwest England, through the peaks and Pennines, and then down into the East Midlands, East Anglia. In the last hour or so, we've seen some thundery downpours across the southeast as well. They're going to linger as well through the night. Some of them pretty slow moving. There'll be a lot of surface water and spray and also some poor visibility, particularly to higher ground, some mist and fog to greet us first thing. Clearer skies in the far west of Scotland, maybe a little fresher here, but that's where we're likely to see the best of the sunshine perhaps for tomorrow. Different story into Aberdeenshire, cloud and rain starting to arrive, some of it persistent in to the afternoon and for England and Wales it's same old same old sunny spells scattered showers some of them are heavy and possibly thundery if you dodge the showers you keep the sunshine you'll see highs of around 20 degrees a fresher feel up into the northeast but low pressure remains in the driving seat little change through this week and actually we could see some persistent rain just lingering across central and southern Scotland with a northeasterly flow making it feel rather chilly elsewhere sunny spells and scattered showers again and some of those really could be quite potent if you catch them. If you dodge them, you keep some sunshine. We'll see temperatures again peaking at 19 degrees, but cooler to the northeast with that northeasterly flow. George. Thank you, Louise. And